So there's been a lot of talk about Nepo babies recently, so kids of successful people who also find success. Um, you have an interesting take on this, and I love your take on this. Can you tell everybody? Uh, yeah, you know, it's I'm forever grateful for everything that my dad had to do to get me the opportunities that I have. Yeah. And if I were to run away from that or shy away from it in any way, in my eyes, that's disrespectful to everything he had to go through. He, yeah. didn't, he didn't work as hard as he did for me to not accept and appreciate it. And so I wear it as a badge of honor. You know, uh, a, a lot of people, when they see me naturally, uh, hey, you're Ice Cube son, you damn right I am. Like, yeah, 100%, right. that's it's my crazy. hero. You know, that, that's, that's, cool. that's my coach. And, you know, at the, at the same time, the door can be open, but you gotta walk through. You know, I have a lot of people, they have an idea of what I'm gonna be before I get to any set because of their idea of what my dad is. Yeah. They think I'm coming to set uh, feeling entitled, or I, I feel like uh, I need to have, quote unquote, a, a posse of, of 15, 20 people with me, you know, straight rap stuff. Yeah. But no, I'm here to work. You know, I, I pride myself on my professionalism, and you know, I'm a Kobe fan, and Kobe taught me work ethic. You know, you, yeah. you gotta grind mama mentality. And uh, actually one thing the late great Kobe Bryant told me is, because he's in the same thing as me as far as following his father's footsteps. He said, your parents are never gonna want you to go through anything. They're never gonna want you to have hard times, but you have to pick yourself up, you have to grind, you have to take the risk, and you gotta make a name for yourself. And that's, uh, that's what I try to do every day. Yeah, the more I learn, the more I like that guy, he had his flaws. But no different from you and I, surrounded by women, but learned to treat him right, became a girl.